This animation will show the guided surgical process flow, using a CBCT skin of the patient, CBCT of the impression, and the Blue Sky Bio Keyless Fully Guided Surgical Kit. The implant used for this video is a Biomax 5mm in diameter and 10mm in length. Radio pig skin markers are attached to the outside of an impression tray. The impression tray is filled with PVS material. Ensure that the material fully covers and surrounds the teeth. Take an impression. The teeth should not touch the tray in the impression. A CBCT skin is taken of the patient with the impression tray in the mouth. The impression is removed from the mouth. A CBCT skin of the impression tray is taken with impression settings. The CBCT of the patient is loaded in the Blue Sky Plan software. The CBCT of the impression is loaded and converted in plan to a digital model. It is then aligned with the patient's CBCT. Implants are selected and digitally placed in the desired position. The guide is designed in the software and location of the guide hole is represented by a brown colored tube in the software. The guide hole will house the master metal guide tube. The tube is automatically positioned in the software to guide the drill in the planned direction and stop it at the correct depth. Print the surgical guide and insert the metal cylinder. The fit of the guide should be verified before the surgical procedure. A flap is raised and then the guide is positioned in the mouth. Insert the 2 by 6 mm drill. Activate the drill within the master tube only after it is inserted in the guide and is centered by the master tube. Drill with copious irrigation and advance until the drill is stopped by the master tube. It is recommended to drill at 800 to 1200 rpm with copious irrigation. Insert the 2 by 8 mm drill without spinning until it advances to the depth created by the previous drill. Activate the drill and advance until stopped by the master tube. Insert the 2 by 10 mm long drill without spinning until it reaches the depth of the osteotomy. Activate the drill and advance with irrigation until stopped by the master tube. The guided pilot hole is now completed. Blue Sky Bio drills have direct cut technology therefore, it is not necessary to use every width in sequence. Proceed directly from the 2 mm drills to the next to last width drill required. In this case it is the 3.9 by 6 mm drill. Insert the drill without spinning until it's centered by the master tube. Activate the drill in advance until stopped by the master tube. Insert the 8mm long drill with same diameter without spinning until it's centered by the master tube. Activate the drill in advance until stopped by the master tube. Insert the 10mm long drill with same diameter without spinning until it is centered by the master tube. Activate the drill in advance until stopped by the master tube. If you determine that the bone is soft, you can skip the next drill diameter and insert the implant at this point. The self-tapping and tapered design of the Biomax implant will compress the soft bone and obtain proper primary stability. If the bone is of normal or high density the final drill diameter is used to complete the osteotomy. In this case it is a 4.6mm wide drill. The 6mm long drill is inserted until it is centered by the master tube. Activate the drill in advance until stopped by the master tube. The 8mm long drill is inserted until it is centered by the master tube. Activate drill in advance until stopped by the master tube. The 10mm long drill is inserted until it is centered by the master tube. Activate the drill in advance until stopped by the master tube. The osteotomy procedure is completed. Insert the implant with the guided insertion ratchet driver. The stop section of the guided driver will stop at the top of the master tube. Further advancement can damage the bone and cause loss of primary stability. The cover screw is inserted into the implant and the flap is sutured. Adequate time is allowed for the implant to integrate. 